If you are a car fanatic and love car transformation shows, then you must be familiar with the History Channel's reality television show, Vegas Rat Rods. Since the show hasn't aired for a few years, most of the fans have been curious about the show's shop owner. So today in this video, we will talk about what Steve Darnell is doing as of 2021. How much do you think Steve Darnell is worth? Leave us your opinions in the comment section below. If you are new here, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon. Watch the video till the end to know everything on the reality TV star Steve Darnell. Steve Darnell is an American reality TV star who went from small-time rancher to becoming one of the heads of the most renowned car customization crew on TV with Discovery's hit reality series Vegas Rat Rods. The show is totally based on the exploits of the Welder Up shop in Las Vegas, which is located at 3160 S Highland Drive, Suite D. Steve and his merry band of misfits go about totally dismantling and restoring classic hot rods. The reality TV star is the Welder Up creative genius. Fueled by the desire to prove the naysayers wrong, he has always been determined to exceed everyone's expectations. Is Steve Darnell married? No, Steve Darnell is no longer a married man. He is divorced from his first wife, whose identity remains somewhat of a mystery. However, there are photos of the two of them together on the internet. Before they separated, the couple had two children together, sons Cash and Chase Darnell. Since 2014, Darnell's kid has been a regular on the show. His children inspired him to strive for a better life. Steve wanted to provide them with a secure future, which led to the start of Welder Up. How much is Steve worth? Steve Darnell has a net worth of $800,000. It is fair to say that Darnell has made most of his net worth from his exploits in car restoration. This started when he was a teenager. Steve would buy old and barely running cars and fix them up, mostly on his own. Later on, he'd sell them at a profit. By the mid-90s, he was making about $1,500 to $2,500 per week from building rod iron. Another source of income stems from merchandising his brand. Items like a QYB Wolf B&W sweatshirt and Welder Up Skull Decal are available on his website for $50 and $10 respectively. When he started Welder Up, he was also reportedly making about $20,000 from his work in production welding. With his earnings, he has also collected some very luxurious and vintage cars, including a 1957 Chevy 210, a 1968 Dodge Charger, and a 1930 Ford Model A sedan. What is Steve Donnell doing as of 2021? Steve Donnell, the store owner, continues to work at Welder Up and keeps his friends and followers up to date on his daily activities via social media, particularly his Instagram account at Welder Up Vegas. In addition, the reality star has his own YouTube channel, Welder Up, where he posts transformation videos. He was recently present at the SEMA booth number 33117 where his fans and followers could meet him, and he even claimed on his Instagram account that he was already counting down the days until next year's SEMA. Hashtag SEMA, hashtag Welder Up, hashtag Welder 101, hashtag Rat Rod. We've reached the end of the video. Did you enjoy the video? Yes? Then give it a thumbs up. For more entertaining videos, please subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon. We'll make sure to be back with more amusing videos in the near future.